Well suited for the Premier League as well. Strength, <sighs> his movement, his goal scoring ability. I think it's a great signing for the money as well, Ali. 50 million. Don't worry about his wages and no, whatever, no. but you got him for 50 million odd. It's funny because he's a bargain. You look at it last season, the amount of people, myself included, looking at City saying brilliant and they're scoring all sorts of goals. You cannot take that away from them. Mm. It's not as if they weren't scoring goals without no. setting forward. I just think he'll give them something else, mate. Yeah, absolutely. No, I think it's a, a brilliant signing. Obviously, Harry Kane was their first choice last season. Couldn't get him. So he just, you know, sat tight. And he still won the league. Really? With no striker. Well, you, you can say Jesus is a striker, yeah, but, but no real... Didn't play a regular... No, not an Aguero. No, no not an Aguero. How do you think Harry Kane's feeling? <clears throat> well, he's, he's got to, he's got to uh, just stay at Tottenham now, hasn't he? I, should, I don't know where else he goes. Where, where, where would he go which is better for him now? Manchester United yeah, it, it depends on what yeah Ten Hag is, is thinking and what they can do next season. Uh, it might take a little bit of time at um, Manchester United, but Spurs are in the Champions League now. So that's they, what I was going to ask you. Ray, um, you know, speaking that's not a bad front three again. If you got Perisic in there as well, that's what I was going to say. Isn't it? Song Kane Perisic, yeah, not bad. Is that is that the immediate area that they should have strengthened though? Um, I, I, because I tell you right now, I think Conte's different class. Right, I really think mm. he's a top top coach. And I think if he is supported in the market and gets two or three in, I think Spurs could kick on. I'm yeah. not saying for a minute yeah. they're going to go and challenge. But it's, all, it's all on Chelsea now as well, isn't it? I mean, that, yeah. they'd be relieved. All the fans would be absolutely 100%. delighted that now it's, it's been settled. Yep. Yeah, it's been settled now. Chelsea uh, have sold the club. Um, and it, 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 it's some good reports coming out saying well no 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 we're going to buy the top players and you know keep doing what we've been doing for the last few years because they've been so successful Chelsea they went for that era when Jose come over um, and they sort of won one trophies for fun well you can say what you like but I mean the success if you go back to Ken Bates when he sold it for a pound yeah. you would never think yeah. in a million years that what they have achieved over the last 10-15 years the success years. they've had under uh, Abramovich has been absolutely staggering it's yeah. been staggering no, you're absolutely right. So that's worth a mention. I think a Chelsea fan, a lot of Chelsea fans will be, I'm not sure relieved is the right word, but I think we'll just be looking forward. I think we're in for a great Premier League again so this year. Because so do I. What do Newcastle do now? They had a great end of the season. They're going to be in the market. Come West Ham for David Moyes. Yeah, you know, on again. I think the owners of West Ham and they've got to trust David Moyes to you know, give them a, give uh, West Ham a little bit of funds to go out and buy uh, players. Arsenal, what's going to happen with Arsenal? We know about Spurs. So Liverpool, will they lose Mane, which is a massive loss if they lose Mane? Well, yeah. That would be a nightmare for him because he's so important player. He's such an important player. Yeah. As I much mean, as salaries. I think, uh, yeah, I think arguably, if, if I mean, if you look at City bringing in Haaland, if Liverpool lose money, dear me. Look, we know I, Diaz is I, a great player. I think he's been I've got to, I think I think Liverpool's recruitment, I keep going on about it, has well, been, it's, it's been second to none. Yeah, it really absolutely. has. Diaz, Jota, yep. going back to Van Dijk and Allison, but no mistake about no, it. Money. I'm thinking to myself, listen, I know Bayern Munich, brilliant club, great club, one of the top clubs in Europe. I'm just thinking, why would you want to, not want to leave Liverpool? Why would you leave Liverpool? No, absolutely. No, you think? I think I'm, I'm amazed by it as well. It looks like he's happy. And he ne- he's in a very, very good team. So yeah. you, when you're in good teams, Ali, you want to try and stay there as long as you can. Of course it's you usually do. your age comes against yeah. you uh, when, he, when he, you've he got youngsters like, coming through. He looks, I, know, I know he switches it about a little bit, Klopp, I get that. And, uh, but at the same time, you'd have to say Manny and Sal are, are kind of the two, not, if not permanent fixtures in the front line, they're as yeah. good, you know, as, good as... But he either plays up top, doesn't he? Or off yeah. the left-hand side. Interesting. Right, back mm. of the sun. Pep is going into the final 12 months of his contract at the Etihad and will not be rushed into signing a new one. He wants to be sure his Manchester City players are still responding to his methods before he commits himself to stay beyond next summer. Asked about the manager's contract, Khaldun Al Mubarak said, Pep has never stayed as long as he stayed here with any club, that's City obviously, be it at Barcelona or indeed Bayern Munich. It's a partnership that has done wonders in years, it's approaching its seventh year, there you are, and next year is going to be an exciting chapter of this partnership. We are enjoying every moment, we're achieving great things together and this conversation will be had at the right time, at the right place and with the pace, time and framework that works for Pep so yep. clearly there's a well he's got all the cards <coughs> isn't he you know if you're playing poker he's got all the aces oh, yeah. because he he, he can uh, what he's achieved again this season winning the, in the title again they're, uh, how they lost to Real Madrid I know Real Madrid in the end it was probably their name was written on the cup some of the uh, games have got Ray, through I think oh, I, I, I said it before before the final I said if, if Real Madrid won that cup 
it's as good as any European Cup Absolutely. Club Champions League they've ever won. Yeah. You look at the teams they knocked out. the three teams, <coughs> Chelsea, Liverpool. And look at the way they did it. City. And look at the way they did it. Yeah. They, were out the, they were out the tournament about two or three times. Yeah, absolutely. And, and somehow came back. But I think, clearly, Pep, fantastic. Four out of five titles. They won they want oh, the Oh, yeah, the Champions League is the one. They State in the obvious. And he, the... he's probably really frustrating him now as well. Because you could just see against Real Madrid, you thought, wow, how did, how did they win that? I mean, that close with, win with a, another great save from Courtois, he's been so important for them, hasn't he? I mean, that, that Jack Brady's <sighs> chance, when he was, oh, that was yeah. in the corner. And he's just got a slight yeah. foot on it and it put, put it wide. And Brilliant that would have save. been game over. That was it, it's finished. Ray, I thought he, he had a couple of saves at the weekend, but I thought he's won from Manny. He puts it onto the post. Yeah, was great ridiculous. Save. Fantastic. He had a great save when Salah takes the brilliant touch. I think he, take, he takes a smashing touch with his left foot, hits it with his right. I thought that was a great in save. In any good team, Ali, you know you got need strikers, you've got to, like, you've got like you played in, but you've got to have a good goalkeeper you, who's going to keep you in games, and in it, certain but, situations in games. It was as if he was a wee bit, I don't know if you heard him, his interview after it, it was as if he was a wee bit peeved, a wee bit annoyed, because he felt he wasn't getting a, a great deal of respect. Mm. From some of the English maybe media and supporters, because the wee first thing he said, the wee dig. <laughs> but by the way, didn't he do well? No, no, he's done brilliant. Now, it was reported yesterday that Bayern Munich striker Robert Lewandowski wants to leave the club. Lewandowski is currently on international duty with Poland. I think they play Wales coming up, actually, Tetra. And the legendary striker revealed this in a press conference My era at Bayern is over. I don't see any possibility to continue playing for this club anymore. Bayern's a serious club and they believe they won't keep me. I don't want to play there anymore. A transfer is the best solution. I hope they don't stop me. Now, this season, Lewandowski scored 50 goals in all competitions for Bayern. Since joining the club in 2014 from Dortmund, I think it was, Lewandowski has scored 238 goals <laughs> in 253 ridiculous. Bundesliga matches. Absolutely ridiculous. That is, eh? Oh, what a record. What do you think... He would want to do. I think that he's going to be going to Barcelona, surely, isn't he? <clears throat> think so. I think, I think that's, he's looking that way. I don't know what Bayern Munich, what sort of money would they want for him? I yeah. think he's got a year left in his year contract. To go. But he's, all the signs are that he'd definitely be leaving now with what he said. Um, because you don't want to keep an un- unhappy player, no. do you? Well, you can't. At that no. age as well. You can't. At that no. age. You can't. Um, so he'll be on his way. I'm just trying to think would he ever come to the Premier League? That's what I'm thinking. Mm. That's why I'm asking the question. I mean, we spoke about Harry Kane potentially Manchester United. It might not be that. Might not be the one. Would that be Ten. Manchester United? Lewandowski. Lewandowski. Yeah, that'd be Some an interesting tiny. one. I mean, he's. You look at him. You look at Kane. Was he thirty three now? Is he? Yeah, thirty three. Still but a couple of years. Speaking yeah, about it, they look after themselves boys, now. Nah, yeah. These boys played to 37, 38 yeah, no, no problem. problem at all. No problem. And he has been absolutely phenomenal. What a player. Yeah. Proper. A great career. Proper goal scorer. Mm. Huh? Yeah, Inter- I mean, really interesting. Well, you can you you the man to say he's oh, a proper goal scorer, or not proper. Mm. And you look, I mean, you look at him and Kane, out and out number nines, out and out yeah. goal scorers. And his movement look, and you know, it's all that half a yard, and he nah. just knows where the back of the net is. He, he don't even he probably don't even look up. He knows exactly where he's going to put yeah. it, and you know, such a clinical finisher, isn't he? Yeah, it's, it's an interesting one. I'm, I'm thinking, I'm thinking out loud here. I'm thinking about somebody like if he's leaving, and it looks like he might be leaving. Yeah, Sadio Mane. You know, yeah, it could be. They, obviously, could be the, obviously, that's the link, isn't it? They're obviously going to be the link. Doing a little bit of work. But if, if I was Liverpool, I'd be doing everything I can to oh, keep mate, Marnie. Mate. Uh, again, it comes down whether it's down to uh, salary or, or what sort of, or he just wants a different change. I don't know. Hundred percent. But why would you want to leave Liverpool? I don't I mean, get it. I don't get I, it. I can see a lot more trophies. Klopp's just, you know, put pen to paper on a big new deal. He looks a great manager to play under. Um, he respects all his players the way he just you know the, the uh, relationship he has with his players looks really good I thought so why interview. would you want to leave Ray, I, don't, I really I, don't get that no particularly going to uh, listen the only thing if you're going to buy me the only thing you're going for you're moving for the club because you're not moving to, you're going to win the title yeah. but you're not, you know, going, you're not moving to a better league I mean the, the, the top flight in England is as good as anything you get absolutely. in the world it's, it's magic but I, I did love I must admit I loved Klopp um, after the game on Saturday clearly emotional hmm. clearly upset for himself and the team and his fans but his last line was brilliant book a hotel for next year yeah that's you know what great I mean? yeah. so he's, 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 a, he's a class manager I mean I, when I look at it I, I can just see the warmth he has with the players yeah. and how he respects it, the, the, the uh, connection now I'm going back to my club I, I think they lost the connection with the fans the, the players yeah. and that is so important but if you look Massive. at Liverpool 
Look at that connection it's after incredible. games when they win a game and he goes up to the cop. And, yeah, you know that, that's the connection they want. Finds and, and I think he's, he's brilliant. I think brilliant. I, 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 if, they, I, if I was picking a manager to play under in, in this era, if I could pick anyone, it's yeah. got to be Klopp, surely. It's funny, isn't it's, it? It's an odd one because no, I, I, Guardiola would be yeah. very successful as well, and I'm sure he's. I agree with if you. If you do your job, he's, you're, he's brilliant to work under. But I just think Klopp's got that little bit more. You'd like to about him? I don't know. I, I, I hear you, and I probably mm. I, I don't disagree with you. Conte as well. I've got Conte. I, I like Conte. You know, yeah. Guardiola, Mourinho back in the day. You'd like to have played for him as well. Yeah, a lot absolutely. of top top coaches. I think an interesting summer for Liverpool. Keep money. Yeah, strengthen a little bit. 